Well, this is something extremely frustrating that if you've experienced, uh, really annoys you. Uh, my B, my N, my space bar key, and my question mark key, and a few of my directional keys have stopped working. And this is my USB keyboard that I use. My laptop keyboard doesn't work either. So um, I was a little frustrated when this happened. So I opened up the keyboard, uh, took off the, the rubber, and there you see the circuits underneath. So I'm just pressing the keys here and just to make sure it wasn't a problem with the rubber domes and uh, sometimes they get ripped and they don't press down properly but as you see here nothing's nothing's showing um, at all and um, yeah this normally indicates that there's a problem with the circuit so whenever we look immediately you see here that the the end the B the spacebar key are connected there so that's immediately a good sign okay yeah there's the question mark key it's connected on the same circuit so keep following the circuit round and to find the break there's the directional keys okay those don't work uh, keep going round until we uh, okay yeah there's the the break there just at the top of the hole in the plastic over that uh, button you see the little dark mark and that's the break in the circuit that is causing me this problem. And there's a close-up of it there. You can see uh, the circuit's broken. And, and this happened. It sometimes worked and sometimes didn't work. And then finally it stopped working altogether. So this is me testing to make sure that that is the only circuit breaker there with aluminum foil. Uh, just press down on it. And that'll bypass the break in the circuit. And if that is the only break, then the keys should start working again. So as you see here, yeah, the keys are working. Um, space bar, yeah. So that is the break in the circuit that's been causing me these problems. And here's the fix. Aluminum foil folded over and then taped down over the circuit breaker. And that should complete the circuit and the keyboard should be fixed. So do one final um, test just to make sure that it's okay. So I'm doing it now um, before I assemble the keyboard. And yep, the keys, well, the B key is working fine. Uh, the N as well. And let's check the space bar. Yeah, that's working as well. So that's my issue um, solved. Uh, so the keyboard is now assembled. And it's just, there's the tape in the background. It's easy to fix. It's cheap to fix. And let's face it, it'll save you $20 or whatever you're going to be paying for a new keyboard. And if you have a gaming keyboard, a fix like this will save you a lot of money. So uh, thanks for watching. I hope it helps.